Hi, we're in the garden. I'm Dave Forehand at the Dallas Arboretum, and today we wanted to talk about how to take care of roses, how to purchase them, and when you get them home, how to keep them and, and preserve them so that they can be beautiful for as long as possible. With Valentine's, uh, Mother's Day in the future, it's a time when a lot of roses are given and purchased, so we thought we'd just chat about that for a bit. First thing you want to do when you go to the store to purchase is to look for roses that are in a cooler and also in water. You want to make sure the stems are in water and that the bunches of roses are in an actual cooler, staying cool. That's a key to making sure that they start off and are going to be good for you. Uh, other things to look for are no damage or blemishes on the petals. You want roses that are pretty firm but just beginning to open, not too tightly budded but not too open. You can kind of actually give them a little bit of a squeeze there to feel it. You want that firmness but not completely tight. Those are things you look for in the store. So you get them home, you want to keep them in water as soon as you get them home, and uh, next steps are to cut the base of each stem at a 45 degree angle. You want a new cut so that there can be plenty of water uh, uh, pulled up by the flowers themselves. A lot of times the cuts kind of heal over and they block water, so when you get them home you want to make a fresh cut at a 45 degree angle uh, to keep it fresh. Usually the roses will come with a little uh, packet inside that keeps the, the, the roses uh, healthy, gives them some nourishment. So you want to add that to your water that you have in the vase uh, at that time. Uh, other steps, you want to keep them away from sun and heat. Even though roses grow in full sun, once they're cut inside, they don't want to be in direct sunlight because it'll make them uh, d diminish and wilt. And another thing, if you have the opportunity to do it, at night when you're not enjoying them and you go to bed, if you could put them in the refrigerator, it'll help keep them fresh much longer. So a lot of neat tips there uh, to help you have the best success with your roses uh, through the uh, spring and summer. 